This is the Navisk Auto rechargeable portable CD player. Let's take it out of the box. Okay, in the box you get a quick start guide along with a full user's manual. Here is the CD player itself, of course. They also include a set of headphones that actually have a very nice wire on them. So uh, that should be really nice. You see how it's kind of like like headphones have today. I don't know how to really explain this wire. It's kind of very like rubbery, if you will, which is nice because that means the wires will flex very nicely. They also include the charging cable. This is USB to a small barrel jack connector, as you see there. And thoughtfully, they've also included a line-in cable, a 3.5 millimeter to 3.5 millimeter, as you see there. So if you have a car, an older car that has, uh, you know, an input on it, but let's say the CD player in the radio is busted, well, you can use this and you can just charge it up when needed. And if your car has a USB port where you have one of those cigarette lighter to USB adapter uh, things, you can plug it in and the car will charge it as well. This is a portable CD player. CD is not dead. It's not going to be dead. You can still buy CDs at uh, a store that would sell these type things, a music store or a big box retail electronic store, stuff like that. And this way you get the album art and all the other good stuff that comes along with it. This particular one is very easy to understand the controls. They're all right here going around. You have your play and pause, stop, forward and back. And you can also set up other things to have it repeat. Repeat one track, repeat the entire disc. It'll even do shuffle. And it doesn't just play CDs, it will play CDs that have MP3 files on them uh, or WMA, WMA files on them. So that means that you don't have to burn actual audio CDs. You can get a typical uh, CD, something like this, that happens to be an RW, and you can just burn a bunch of MP3s to it and it can play them natively. This one I actually have burned with regular CD audio from the YouTube audio library, so there won't be any copyright matches. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, get this plugged into a speaker so you can hear it, and then um, that way I can give you a sample of it. I just wanna show you the uh, power switch and whatnot right over here. You can see it has off, on, and hold. The hold function, of course, will allow it to keep running and it will ignore any button presses, so that way it'll keep playing. Volume plus and minus, there's a uh, little wheel here that you push to one side and raise the volume and push to the other side at a lower. This control here will open it up so you can put in a disc, your headphone jack there, a charge indicator and where the plug plugs in to actually charge it. So to operate, it's really, really simple. We can just open that up. It'll open. We'll take our disc, put it down. You snap it on the spindle like that. Close that up, and we'll put the control to on. You'll see the screen is backlit, as are the buttons, which is very, very convenient. So this is going to read the disc here, table of contents says there's 11 tracks and it starts playing. Let me raise the volume up. So you can see the display there will show you the timer uh, that has elapsed on the track, and there's probably other modes you can have the display set to as well. We can go ahead and go to the next track. And of course, this will just play CDs all day. This does have 60 seconds of anti-skip. So if I shake it, the music keeps playing. 
without any trouble. You can, of course, fast forward by holding the button down. You can see how it'll skip forward like that. So just a plain old portable CD player like we had back in the 90s. Still a great, great thing to have all around. You never do know. You can plug it into anything. Maybe you got rid of your CD player on your home stereo system. Well, you can get something like this and just plug it in with uh, the right adapter cable. And this way, if you still have old CDs or somebody brings one, well, you can play them very simply like that. And you don't really have to worry about recharging this much because it has an 18-hour battery life for playback. So that's really nice also that the battery lasts quite a long time. So once again, this was the Navisk Auto rechargeable portable CD player. If you'd like to purchase this item, I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find it available for sale on Amazon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.